Hello Taurus, welcome to my channel. This will be a reading for the month of April. Uh, please do bear in mind that these are general readings so may not resonate for everybody so do take what does and leave what doesn't. If you like the reading please do like, share and subscribe. I very much appreciate that. All right Taurus, so for this reading I will be uh, using a form of divination known as caromancy which is essentially candle wax reading i'll be lighting this and and i'll allow the wax to go into the water and i'll read from there and then of course i'll be pulling out some cards uh after that um caromancy goes back to the celtic times spread to the romans and then spread to other parts of the world like the caribbean central america's area and then and then um other places as well so love doing this um let me just get it ready and uh let us begin let us begin taurus okay okay taurus okay oh Mm -hmm. Taurus, what I am seeing here, fairness, fairness, equality, you've been looking for something, you've been waiting, or you've been going through something uh, that deserves fairness. You've been waiting for an opportunity to get that equal, possibly equal pay or equal, um, there's an equality there, that's what I'm seeing. Whatever situation that there is, you're getting uh, that fairness coming through for you. There is uh, a, the, the approach to this situation or issue that you've had will be very fair. Uh, it serves you really, really well that you should know. So things are starting to balance out. If you've been going through something that may have been a little bit rocky or unsteady, really, things are starting to equalize. Things will start being a lot fairer. And um, I, what I see here is that uh, you, you're moving away from... Uh, Somebody around you may have been quite judgmental or judgy, and I see you moving away from that, that that person is, like, leaving your surroundings. Um, yeah, that's, that's just a message that I have to put across. Um, there is a lot of, um, you know, you've been tackling different kinds of issues, uh, tackling business affairs and things like that. And I see something coming to a completion, something is being done, finished, and the outcome is very positive. So, you know, you've been um, hard at work, tackling through many different things. I see you juggling many different things. And you have been working towards a certain result, and that outcome comes out quite positive. You're, I see you being very pleased and happy with results that, uh, that you're going to get. And you are pursuing, it's like you're pursuing a certain matter that's very close to your heart. Um, it could be legal affairs or something. There's something there that, that you've been, uh, you know, you've been really wanting to you, just not give up not giving up at all and I, and and i see here justice justice is coming through that connects to the uh, thing i was saying in, in the beginning it seems like april is definitely a a month for oh you see the sizzling that sizzling is confirmation for you for you to look out for for you to focus on it's a month for uh getting your justice, for getting that fairness coming to you. Things are going to really move along. And once you have tackled these certain um, challenges, I see doors opening for you. Doors start to open up for you. More than one door, and it's open wide, and it's there for you. And, and you come out on the other side 
very and it's I see courage. I see you being brave. You come out stronger. You're definitely coming out stronger here and more alive. There's a lots of um, vitality after this, and it's it's like these challenges you accept uh, because you there's great optimism in you winning whatever it is that comes your way. You know, it's like you you um, have passed any self doubt, and now you're in the uh, positive frame mind here, highly optimistic, and it's good because like you you've managed to, um, you know, take control of how you see things and what you allow and what you don't. Good news is coming in. You're getting uh yeah again. I see good news coming in. You're getting like a, a stroke of luck with certain things. I see feminine energy also. So it could be some uh, uh, someone that's close to you that is of a feminine energy. Uh, could be helping you out. Um, that person is a good source for information and advice. Um, and, and they have something that um, is useful for you. And um, you're not going to be easily fooled. If you come into a situation where someone thinks uh, that they can, you know, um, be a little, like, not so honest, let's say, uh, you, you, know, you can see straight through them. It's, it's what I'm getting here. But there are opportunities coming in. There are definitely, once a completion is done, once you've completed a certain task here, you know, whether that's to do with your personal life or professional life, there's, there's a, 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 a new beginning. There's a sense of a new beginning, a new start, new connections happening. I see you meeting new people. It's a month of of finish of going through something, completing it, and entering into something new, and it's bright. It's a new space that you're going into. So possibly, maybe you're moving or something, or you're starting a new job or a new school. There's just something there that brings you a lot of um, harmony. You know, you're gonna just feel very good there because I see new people, new friendships, new relationships. Uh, you know, it's a, it's a new space that you're entering here. And also, um, uh, for some, I see if, if somebody is, is honoring their uh, promise to you, and it could be you as well, honoring your promise is something that's going to be honored. And um, it's it, it, in here, it's, it's, kind of significant because it helps you out a lot and if it is you that is honoring something then um you know i just see uh people admiring you admiring how genuine you are and um and it's something that they don't forget it you know you get it gets uh, paid back to you For some, I do see new relationships, by the way, or like a rebirth in certain relations with people. This is good. Okay, let's see what the cards have for you. Okay. Let's see what the cards have. For Taurus, please. For Taurus. The Empress. Mm -hmm. The High Priestess. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Strength. I was think I, I was talking about strength, right? That's a big one here. That's a big one. Okay, the Empress, the High Priestess, and strength. Wow, you're really coming into your own. You're trusting your instincts here. Oh, and uh, we have the five of wands here. But for now, <laughs> what 
we have something that is um, highly. Uh, there's so much potential in this in in um, in something that you're going through. There's so much potential for something to be extremely successful, and it's like almost you know what to look for and and once you're there it turns to gold that kind of feeling that kind of power that you're holding you know and you're so determined and you it's it's that optimism as well that you're entering you know that state of mind that frame of mind here that is so strong within you because you feel it you know you you're you you're connecting to your highest senses here and you have the guts to go through whatever challenge that there is you know, you're courageous and it pays off because look here with the five of wands is is connecting so strongly to to this. It's it's you as I said, I was saying you're accepting challenges. This is it. But it pays off. It pays off. And it's it's like you're ready to go into whatever competition there is. Because look, I said it pays off and then we get the chariot. That's a complete yes answer there. That's your victory. You're marching towards victory here. You're unafraid of the competition because you know whatever you have is, is the best thing out there. Oh, the Hierophant. Look, I love this for you. And also here I do see a, a good balance, that fairness that we were talking about. This, uh, there's an approach that's coming that's going to um, kind of have you understand so much more about the position that you're in and what's going on. And here with the Hierophant, there is this authoritative figure as well around you that is um, someone that can guide you and that, that's trustworthy, you know. But um, you are potentially also the Hierophant. You, have, you hold that energy. It's like uh, what I sense here, Taurus, is that you, you, you will be proving quite a few people wrong if they did not believe in something that you want to do and you prove them wrong and something that you believed would work out and it does work out you know you're holding on to um, a vision and you're making it happen here you have great faith in your visions in yourself and that's amazing you know, because look, it, it's it's like nothing is going to stop you. You're unafraid. You have that courage. I love this. This is a beautiful confirmation for you. I love this for you, Taurus. Um, and I, I hope that this helped and was able to get give you some kind of guidance. Um, and I hope you enjoyed it. And I want to thank you all so much for your donations, your support. It truly means so much to me. I am truly uh, so grateful. And uh, please do take care of yourselves, Taurus. Love you all. Thank you all. Until the next time.